I'm here at a forum HDB BTO in Canberra and this is my husband's friend's place which I'm going to show you around. So right from the entrance, there is this huge carpentry done from the entrance all the way to the living room. And I got to know from the owner that this carpentry alone costs about 7000 And the owner is a fan of Iron Man and his whole collection costs about 10000 And over here, this is his most expensive collection. This is probably a thousand, and above that is seven hundred. So he has more figurines coming in. Some are still at his old place, and some are still uh, in pre order. So here, this is the Xiaomi 65 inch TV. I think the model is E65S Pro. And according to the wife, it's a bit too big for this space. And I have a clock here. Let me open up and show you. So they bought the Broadling hub, which has the RF and IR function, but they didn't use it. So if they were to connect it, they could control the blind system. This is the motorized blind, which they routed to the switch and it's supposed to work with Broadlink so you know they can do the home commands with Google like uh, okay Google open the blinds and it should it should come down but I think they didn't bother so they prefer to use the switch So they install all these car switches all over his home and he can control it from his phone app. He could do voice command with Xiaomi Xiaoi and he has this, it's a wireless switch. So if he were to go to bed, he could press this, which he configured to switch off everything and leave that light on. Now, for the dining area, they have this movable table, which is super convenient. They could eat over there, and if they want to watch TV, they could move to somewhere in the middle. And if they don't like it, they could even fold it down to like the size of a tall side table and stow it away. Oh, I really like this table. I can imagine myself using this table in my home to put my camera. Over here, they did an open concept kitchen. So instead of having cabinets on this two sides of the wall, they did an L shape and a vertical cabinet where they put their microwave and oven here and I imagine how the owners will use this space the drinks over there cooking, preparation of food dishwashing and then the oven is here it's just really spacious to work around and if I need more space I could always use this table because it's movable I'll just pull it in it could be an additional worktop if I need to prepare a lot of stuff and if I walk further in from the kitchen I'm in the service yard they have two washers here and for some reason this is a lot more spacious than the other forums that I've seen oh I noticed there is a motion sensor here which I assume he's gonna use it to trigger the lights are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Been trying to get out. Okay, let me show you the baby's room. And I can feel their excitement waiting for the baby. And I remember being 
in the baby's room every day waiting for Emma to be born and setting up all this baby stuff. I just can't imagine how excited they are at this point waiting for the baby. And for me, that feeling is very different now. Looking at her, she's all grown up. She's three years old now. And I really miss, you know, holding her when she's a baby. Yeah, she doesn't listen to me, right? Do you listen to mommy? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. Okay, give me the phone. Oh, are you sure? Yes. Okay, can we keep the phone? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> Next to it is the study, and it's a very comfortable space. All night, we haven't talked in months, but that's all right. Was wondering if you wanted to go for a try. And now I'm in the master. So it's a very spacious master room. And they have built cabinets on this side of the wall. And I've gotten permission to open some of the cabinets here. Let me give you another view. Oh, that's a 55 inch Xiaomi TV. And I know they have a wireless switch here. So it controls one of the lights. So that's the good thing about installing car switches because you get to buy all this wireless switch and make it two-way. You can just put it wherever you like. You don't have to install it on the wall if you don't want to. You could put it under your pillow if you want. Okay, this is the last space that I'm going to show you. The master bath. A very simple layout and if you're interested this whole renovation just for the carpentry alone it costs about 26,000 it excludes all these accessories that you see in the bathroom and those as well I just need some fresh air and an old friend I'm so glad that we started talking again you turn up the radio I love this song remember when we used to stay up all night long How's it been going though? How's it mom? The roads are so empty, this is so damn calm. If we stick on the highway, we can drive all night long. If it's fine by you, I'll take the passenger seat. We can drive around to the sky and see me. If it's fine by you, I'll take the passenger seat. I got my hand to the window, feel the ocean. Alright, that's it for this video. I hope it helps you visualize your space and uh, if you'd like to see more house tour let me know in the comment section below and i will see you in the next video bye are we going again just you and i on another one of our famous midnight drives